So, I just released this video where I'm talking about Ludwig's video about how he made a secret channel that no one knew about and how it blew up, right? And I said in it how weird it was that so much of his viewership on this video came from YouTube search. I'm like, why would they be searching for this video, this random video on a, on a dead channel, like three days after it released? So, the video that he released, released on the 2nd of November, right? He had a podcast on the 3rd of November where he talked about making this video. And so what I did is I wrote an entire script for a video. I hired a guy from Fiverr to voice over. It's like a video essay and then I hired someone to edit it and then I uploaded it on a brand new channel but sure with zero subscribers. Topic. Surely not. And then I, I like the goal is basically to see if I could get like a thousand views on it. No one could search uh, it based on that. And I did. I did it in, in less than a day. Wow. Wait, how, what's did, the, how did it even get video? viewed? You just like hit the <laughs> algorithm enough? No, it wasn't even. I mean, it's actually hitting the algorithm a bit now. But what I did, it's like a video essay on Mizkif. It's like a <laughs> really good, I think, pretty well written one. Uh, it's basically like how a door made the streamer a million dollars is the title. <laughs> this is the title. I think most of his success comes from like his open door policy. And then it's like three minutes and I had, uh, I just donated to him and then he watched it. Like on a he even says the length. And so this comes out on the 3rd of November. A day after he makes the video, right? So he's he's promoting it on a podcast. I'm like, well, he's only done it once, right? No, he does it again. He does because the same podcast thing goes on to Google on November the fourth. But then, like, okay, it was done. No, but then he goes on November fifth and says the exact same thing here. He's promoted the video in on three different platforms in a very specific way. There's no link, but people can clearly search for the video. They can clearly search for it, and. If something is searched for a lot, it does get a boost in the algorithm. I've explained much of this and I know this is true. So the search came first and then it took off in the algorithm. This video, which has reached 4 million people, was a scam. Misinformed 4 million people. Still being referenced to this day as a legitimate test. Can you believe that? 